I'm gonna invite Sid Kitson to come forward. Let's hear it for Sid, everybody. Hey everybody. Oh boy, I hope you all have a good time. Um, this is really a, a, a very special day, but it really is an, a, an opportunity for us to be reminded as to as to why we're here with a foundation of what we of what we really wanted to create here we want to be we want to prove that a new town a new city can work hand in hand with the environment and because of all of you that's what we've been able to do sustainability talking about resiliency i know we all have been through so much here and innovation. Those are the hallmarks of what we are at, at Babcock Ranch. And all of you live that uh, every single day and we're gonna continue to, to, uh, to do that. Yes, we are the first solar power town in America, but I'm gonna kind of give you a little bit of an overview of some of the, the other things that we're doing. By the way, up at the solar field, we're building, uh, well actually Florida Power Light is building a solar education center. And so by about mid next year, you'll be able to go up there and uh, go up the tower and see the 700,000 panels that are in 840 acres that powers the town of, of Babcock Ranch. So I hope that uh, when that's done, that you'll be able to take, uh, take advantage of that. Many of you know that we have six new parks that we're building along Babcock Trail Road. They're, and they're under construction. Uh, they'll be available uh, uh, next year. One of the things that I'm really excited about is the state of Florida provided $1.5 million for us to, to build a, a park for that's inclusionary for people with disabilities. This is gonna be the best and most inclusive park in the state of Florida. And I can't tell you how proud I am of this and how excited I am. And when you see this equipment, it's, by the way, it's all custom made. And, uh, and I think everyone's gonna really uh, enjoy that. Also, you, everybody knows that we're building the ball fields uh, in, in, uh, behind the school. I think that'll uh, relieve some of the pressure over at Jack Peoples Park. I see so many of the kids running around, uh, you know, with the soccer and they, they're squeezed in over there. I think it's going to be great that we've got those uh, ball fields that are going to be available to, uh, to everybody. A couple of other things. Um, we have more shopping coming. In order to be sustainable, I can keep asking, when's the shop? More shopping, more shopping. Well, we're going to break ground here in the next uh, 30 to 60 days on Yellow Pine. We've got an entire new shopping center that's going to open up. In addition, we're in the final planning stages of B Street, which is right behind us. That's going to go straight down. That's going to have restaurants and shopping and residential. And we'll start that next year. So there were some really exciting things that I think you're all going to really, uh, really enjoy. Okay. I need your, I need your help here. I'm going to tell you something that we haven't announced yet. I was told I can't announce this. But I know we're, you guys will keep it a secret for me, right? I'm looking at some people I know, they don't know how to keep a secret. So um, we're very, very fortunate in that um, in addition to Lee Health, Tampa General is going to be coming to Badcock Ranch to create what I think is going to be the great, uh, one of the best health systems uh, in, in, the, uh, in, in Florida. We have two wow. phenomenal uh, health, health care providers at Badcock Ranch. You're going to see announcement and some of the innovative ideas that they're going to bring and if you have a chance look up tampa general they're one of the top uh, medical facilities in the entire country and certainly in the top uh, few here in in the uh, state of florida so again that has not been announced um so you heard it first <laughs> um, one one of the things i get asked a lot about is state road 31. um i ask about it myself so uh, the good news is is that we're starting construction on State Road 31 uh, next year, early next year. And, I, and there's been a lot of talk about how that's going to work. I want you to know that the existing State Road 31 is going to be touched, but the four lanes are going to be built to the east of that road. So you're going to be able to watch it go up. It's going to start next year, and hopefully the state will follow right behind us uh, with the new bridge, which I know everyone here would be is going to be very, very excited about. And of course, we're going to be adding... Uh, trails uh, throughout the community and, uh, and hopefully everyone will, will, will take advantage uh, of that. So a lot of exciting things happening, but again, it's all grounded in sustainability, our environment, doing the right thing, all of us. And there are going to be things that we're going to ask you to do as the years go on here and how we can talk about food and, and recycling food and the organics. And, and we have so many ideas and things that we're going to, we're going to talk to you about. And uh, hopefully you all will participate.
You know, when I, every year that I have a chance to talk to all of you, one of the things I tell you time and time again, it's what makes Babcock great are the people. And that's just, that's just the way it is. It's the people. It's not, it's not the buildings and the structure, but, it, but it's you. And I, I can't tell you how important it is. So regardless of where you are from or what your heritage is, what your background is, let's show a lot of compassion, a lot of caring, a lot of love for each other. Let's prove to everyone in this state, in this country, what real community is about. And that can happen and will happen right here at Babcock Ranch and it's because of you. So I thank you all so much for being here. Remember what we stand for. Let's keep doing it. We're gonna keep pushing innovation, folks. It's gonna keep coming and we're gonna do the very best that we can to show the world that you can, that you can build a new city and have it work hand in hand with the environment. Thank you all for being here. Have a wonderful day, everybody.